Hey guys, how's it going? I had a request to do a tutorial on guys, so I thought I'd make that for you today. Um, you need to put your capo on the second fret, and super quickly, so you guys can hear what it sounds like. I'll play a little for you. I was missing the guys in my Anyway, um, as you can probably see, it's a super simple song. I'm only really playing the re chords the whole way through, which in relation to this capo is E5, your power chord, um, A major, and then Maddie's weird G sharp minor, whatever it is, chord. Um, well, we'll get into it straight away. So if, all you're going to need to do for your E what you want to do is you want to put your index finger on the actual ninth fret, seventh in relation to the capo, but the ninth fret on the A string, and then the eleventh fret on the E, on the G, D, and the G. So that's your E shape, but he lets the two bottom strings, which you don't normally play in a power chord, he lets them play out. And then the other one we're going to play for the verse is I just take off my index finger and I slide my mid ring finger and my pinky from the 11th fret all the way down to the 4th or 2nd in relation to your capo. So I always remember it as, you know, you got your double dots on 12. So one short of double dots on 12, your index finger on the single dot of 9. And then I slide that down to 2nd fret compared to the capo. That's your verse, and then your chorus is Maddie's G sharp whatever chord, which is middle finger on the fourth fret in relation to the capo. So it's really the sixth, but the fourth fret, and then your index finger goes to the fourth fret of the D, and your pinky, sorry, not index, your ring finger, and then your pinky goes to the fourth fret of the um, D as well of the G. So. That shape that we were doing for the E, which is, well, the sun's in the way, which was 9, 11, 11, and then how he just took off that finger and slide, slid that down to 2. Slide that up to 4, and then put your root finger or your middle finger onto the 4th fret as well. And then slide that whole shape up to, ele shape up to 11, then down to 2, and then back to 11. And then, as you see, like, you got 11, that's muted, so 11, mute, 11, 11, and then you just move that index finger to the ninth, and you're back in the verse. And that is the entire song. It's just... With my right hand, I'm just strumming mostly, but I'm putting a little more emphasis on my up strings to hit these two high, the two open, the high E and the B, just because, like...
which is how you would normally pay power chords, which is what I'm playing it as. Like, the reason that guys sounds nice is because of the change of using those bottom two strings. So the... So really, I'm playing the power chord mostly at the beginning. I'm going... But every now and again, I'm doing an intentional, like emphatic hit of the bottom two strings to make it pop and then and it's the same most of my upstrings upstrokes I'm making hitting the bottom two strings like on purpose just to make it sound like sound how Maddie plays it but literally it's just three chords the whole song Alright guys, that's it. I uh, hope you enjoy. If you have any other requests of covers or tutorials, just put them in the comments and I'll do them for you. Thanks guys, that's it.